Most bees are not a threat at all in the least. If you're out in the wild and you're approaching a hive, that's probably your biggest concern, something you want to be aware of. But in our home gardens, walking by shrubs that are covered with bees, their focus is to collect food for their hive, and that's what they're focusing on. As long as they don't face a personal threat by you, they're really just going to leave you alone if you leave them alone. And so what we can do as individuals is really try to ensure that they have uh, sources for food and sources, uh, places to actually nest also providing flowering sources throughout the year with a focus on native plant species is really going to be helpful to ensuring their survival. So you want to look at a water source where they can't drown, so if you have a shallow source of water or maybe some pebbles so they have a way to climb out or a stick, um, that's a great thing to draw them to the, to the space. So another thing we can do is make sure that we're reducing or entirely eliminating chemical use on our properties because it can have very significant negative impacts to their survival. Bees are a critical link to our ecosystem and they are responsible for pollinating over 80% of the world's flowering plants and 75% of the crops that we have here in the United States. Um, to me, it's, it's, they're really an incredible uh, group of insects that is um, well adapted to the environment and something that we should be protecting and looking out for.